Bad first date? Getting ghosted? Stood up? Blocked again? Let John and Chantel help with their 7.30 second date update. Going to help out Jenna from Bountiful. Hi, Jenna. Hey, how's it going, guys? Welcome to the show. Thanks for dropping us a DM. We appreciate it. Thanks for picking me. I appreciate <laughs> yeah. it. So uh, tell us what's going on between you and it's Philip, right? Yeah, Phil, yeah. yeah. Um, so Phil and I, we met on an app uh, a week before the holidays. And it's obviously such a crazy time, but we really wanted to meet. So he suggested that we finish up our holiday shopping together and then just grab drinks after. That's fun. Yeah. I like this date idea. <laughs> so how'd it go? Yeah. So I thought it went great. I mean, it's like such a magical time, you know, during the holidays. And I we had so much fun. And it was really, yeah, he like was so sweet. He asked me to pick out a gift for his mom. Nice. And yeah, I love that. And um, so then afterwards we got drinks and it was a little rushed, but I didn't really think much about it, you know, because it's really busy. So it didn't seem like a red flag to me. That seems like a fun date because you're kind of helping each other pick yeah. out gifts and uh-huh. you don't know each other so you're kind of learning you get to know each other really fast yeah, don't you in a yeah. creative way yeah y- you say that it's rushed did he say anything at the end to make you feel like oh he's not into this no i mean the only thing i he like teased me about my drink choice which was i got a mudslide oh, <laughs> so okay. um Interesting. He was, yeah maybe that he was, was just commenting like, it. i you know i i don't see a lot of mudslides being ordered so i've I, never heard of this drink yeah so i think maybe he was just making conversation <laughs> To me. Yeah, I mean, exa- yeah, I mean, I thought about it over and over, and that that's really all that I could come up with. You like him, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, and he seemed like such a good guy. He really did. Yeah. Okay, well, then um, let's get this for you. You like him. He's a good guy. I feel good. Um, why yeah. don't we get Phillip's number? We'll play a song, and, and we'll just call him up. Awesome. Thank you. I appreciate that. Mix 105.1 and 103.9. It's John and Chantel with your second date update. Helping out Jenna. I love Jenna's story with Philip. Met online. I know it's cute. And uh, they ended up doing Christmas shopping together, and bought for each other's like parents. Like helped out with gift ideas. Yeah. And uh, since then the holidays, you know, of course it's been crazy. And she's like, I don't know. There's nothing that really is standing out as a red flag. So, uh, Jenna, we're gonna call up Philip. Just listen in and let's see what happens. Okay. Okay. Thank you guys. Hello. Hey, uh, is this Philip? Yes, it is. Philip, hi. Uh, my name is, is John. Philip? Yeah, uh, I'm John. Chantel's with me. Hi. We both do a morning radio show together on Mix Hello? 1051 and 1039. Um, in fact, we're calling because you went out on a date with Jenna. This was a while ago before uh, Christmas. And, you know, you haven't called her back. And we just want to know what's going on. Uh... Yeah, this that that's that's a tough one. Uh, well, what's going on? Yeah, well, you know, Jenna's everything anybody could want, right? Mm-hmm. I mean, she's like super sweet and fun and gorgeous and everything, but uh, yeah, but what? I, I just, <laughs> just I'm like, just uh-huh. getting to the point. What? <laughs> yeah, I well, I was going to tell you, I, I I cannot imagine that I would be what she's looking for honestly uh well philip i gotta tell you we, we we talked to jenna for a while and i mean i could i could just feel the the energy and the smile in her voice like she asked us to help her figure out what went wrong and so maybe you yeah, could just help us well, with that i i don't know how to put this but um so I, I i come from a modest background and she definitely does not and I, I just don't think I could ever give her the kind of experiences she would um, most likely be used to. Like how, what kind of experiences do you think that she would miss out on by being with you? Well, I mean, okay, so all right, example. Uh, maybe she told you we did some holiday shopping together, which was great. Yeah. Uh, the only problem is, yeah, yeah, she's going all out. Like $300 perfume for her mom. I didn't I didn't know you could even spend that much on perfume. and And then... Uh, this super pricey silk scarf, and uh, you know, I meanwhile I'm getting this three wick candle for my mom from her favorite <laughs> shop. Yes. You know, yeah. <laughs> and, uh-huh. I see what you're saying. I mean, my budget was like 
<laughs> yeah, my budget was probably like less than a tenth of hers for each each person. Uh, so, you understand? Yeah. Yeah, just different you, you family backgrounds financially. I, I feel tough. I feel so humiliated right now. Uh, Philip, I got to let you know that. Oh, who? Yeah, Jenna's been listening in. Who? Jenna, what do you want to say? I I. How? I just I can't believe you don't like me for such a superficial reason. Uh. Well, hey, you, you know, Jenna, first, you know, look, I, I, I'm really sorry. Uh, it's just, I mean, it's nothing, it, it's nothing personal or anything. Uh, it's just, uh, you know, uh, I just can't compete with that. I'm just a regular guy, you know? But who's asking I mean, you to, com- to compete with anything? I didn't. Uh, I, I just don't think I'd be able to take you on the kind of dates you're used to. Is Good. Uh, Good. Because <laughs> I don't want to go on those kind of dates. I'm, I'm, I'm sick of that. Like with shallow guys who just want to mooch off me or just want me to make them look good. I, I want to have fun getting to know someone who likes me for me. And I thought that maybe that could be you. Yeah, I, I, I really, yeah, I do like you, <laughs> uh, for sure. Um, so what then? But I just really intimidated. It's just, I'm just super intimidated. That, that's all. Well, uh, it, it would be really cool if you could look past that and, and give me another chance. Yeah, I, I don't know what to say, honestly. I, I'm just... You know what, Phil? You know, I was so touched by how much thought you put into the candle you got for your mom. Because, right. really, it, that's what it should be about, about the thought. I mean, come on, fill up. Like, you you made a good impression. Like I think get to know each other. Yeah. And, and in fact, we'll take the, the stress away. We'll pay for the next meal. Like, are you interested in another date? Uh, y- y- yeah, she just... She seems super awesome, and I, yeah, I, I, I'd be crazy to say no. You would be, uh, yes, especially if it's, yeah, if it's a free meal. And no, I'm kidding. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let, let's let's do it. Let's go for it. Uh, thank you. Wow.